So welcome to our YouTube channel. This is Roger and today is another day. Uh, this is just an update after the typhoon here in uh, the Philippines, uh, specifically here in uh, San Carlos. Um, last night, the, the wind is so strong. Um, there's a rain, but not that strong. So, and as you can see uh, right now behind my back, um, I'm in, uh, as you can see, I'm in the ocean right now. Or, um, I guess uh, I decided to come here to see what's the situation in um, the ocean. So, as you can see now, the waves is not as strong, strong the breeze so totally like hopefully going back to normal and uh, people here in San Carlos are like so busy preparing all the like fixing their houses and they're buying stuff like uh, they're, they're buying um, wood metallic in order to repair their their houses and uh, uh, sad to say for those people that who had whole like their houses is like made of wood or light materials they absolutely freak out like their house is damaged their the roof is flying um, and um, all I can say if have something to help I could I want to really help them but um, yeah we're in the same situation right now that it's really hard and you know I'm trying to um, like I said or we said a while ago that we are worried about because um, I tried to call my parents last night and yesterday they you know, never answered the phone or their numbers and attended but um, maybe later today I will call them again and ask what would be their situation and for Esme's family in Cebu um, they're they're actually safe but the thing is like the, the trees that like fell down and uh, like one of the the house was like really freak out or damage so once again the, the typhoon right now is like can away to like other places I guess so here in San Carlos is like going back to normal still there's a wind there's no rain um, it's like yeah it's like good already and uh, but st still we have to be cautious we have to prepare and yeah especially those people who whose houses like uh, they're made of bamboos or wood or light materials they have to fix it as soon as possible because we do not know rain will come and um, hopefully they will be okay and also uh, what I'm hoping for is that the, the government will help us also and as you can see earlier today early this morning the room around I and um, go around to see what would be the uh, the damages or the like um, the after uh, like after or the results after the the strong wind last night so um, really bad because their houses trees and the bad thing is I asked like one person um like working in uh like the power or electricity uh he said that it would take a month so hopefully not because um that would be really hard for us because we have to work and um people will say okay um uh, this is too bad we can't work and then how's how we can how we can earn money so uh, the thing there because a lot of posts are pulled like you know damage like fell down because of that strong wind so they said it, it would take 
a month so that's really bad and on the other hand um, we do not know other places or cities especially those high cities like Cebu uh, Samar the situation is really bad or worse than here compared in San Carlos so we are covered uh, here in San Carlos the good thing is we're co covered like high or tall mountains unlike Cebu uh, unlike Cebu uh, Leyte uh, Tacloban those higher places for sure the damages or the damage is much worse than here in San Carlos and um, hopefully people there are safe and hopefully there's no like dead people or whatsoever because uh, we, don't, we don't want that to happen and hopefully they're, they're safe and uh, hopefully they can fix their houses as soon as possible and um, I would like to ask like hopefully the government would support and give them a huge of help especially food and everything so I think that would be all just give you a quick an update about the situation here in the Philippines and hopefully once again people are okay and yes thank you so much for your prayers and everything guys and hopefully you're doing great as well and I hope to see you in the next vlog see you bye